Hello, <coughs> my uh, fellow Android users. Um, today is a big day for all of us. Um, we all now possess the knowledge that Android 4.0 is well on its way to our devices. Um, as you, most of you know, that there is an SDK out that a lot of people are already tinkering with, playing with. There's going to be ROMs being thrown out and stuff um, that I'm, might I add, not going to play with. I'm just going to wait for the official release. Well, it depends. I'm 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 waiting for November. If it doesn't if it doesn't come by the first of December, if I don't have an upgraded um, you know software by then, then I'm going to look into getting uh, a 4.0 ROM on my phone. And a lot of, for those of you who don't know what a ROM is, that is um, it's when you tweak your phone a little bit and you just install like, you know, your own software that people have, uh, have made and donated to the community. Um, Oh my gosh, but Android 4.0 is amazing. It is going, um, and this is like really, this is like my unbiased opinion, you know, because I've had an iPhone and I've had an Android, and I'm just, I can say that this is going to blow the iPhone's iOS 5 away. I mean, and the iPhone, iPhone along with it. Um, yeah, it's that good. It's amazing. Um, for those of you who haven't seen it, go, go and look. Just Google or YouTube search Android uh, 4.0 demos, and uh, you will see um, what it's like. It's just amazing. Um, it has an instant shutter camera, no lag, bam. Um, and you're, uh, you've got multitasking. You know, where you just click, you just scroll up and down, and all your stuff is there. If you don't want it, you just swipe to put it away. I mean, it's just a completely different interface than what we've been dealing with with this, you know, gingerbread. This is a uh, 2.3 running here, and you know, it's like I said. I mean, we just get tired of, of what is it? This is scrolly, scrolly, scrolly. That's all we have, and then we have the widgets, and they're awesome. But I don't really ever, you know, like I like the weather widget here. Um. Can't really see it. I was hoping that was gonna render, but it didn't. Um, yeah, and I mean, I like the music. Don't get me wrong; I'm not downing widgets. I'm just saying those aren't enough to make this fun every single day. You know what I mean? Um, so yeah, I mean, when Android 4.0 is what I've been waiting on that I didn't know I was waiting on. I saw Honeycomb and I, I thought that was awesome and I considered putting it to here, but that's for big tablets, obviously. And it would be weird on here. It would be really tiny and I would hardly see anything and then, you know, it would just be weird. Um, so finally, they've made Android 4.0. I mean, it's like, um, Really, it's what I've been waiting for. Like that's why I'm like, you know, seriously consider getting an iPhone because I just need that change. Honestly, Android has let us down as users. It really has as mobile users. Um, it brings me back to my days of Helio. Um, for those of you who do not know what that is, that was the first phone company to ever have 3G. Um, and when it came out, it was hot. It was hot. Uh, it had every single phone had 3G. It had these awesome devices that were doing things that phones before it had never done. It had MySpace integration. It came with it, and that's back when MySpace was a big deal. That's before. Um, that's before Facebook was the ruler. Um, and MySpace was a big deal. So they were advertising this with MySpace. It's like quick instant MySpace integration and this was new phones were never doing this no phones were doing this it had its own MySpace app and no phones had that um, so it had that it had 3G it had 
it had high resolution uh, cameras um, before any of them. I mean, they, it was all you know. If any phone had a camera, it was a 1.3. These phones that were coming out had three megapixel cameras, and that was a big deal to us. We're like, holy shit, you know, this is actually a camera that we can consider using, you know, um, to take good shots. You know, it's like, well, okay, maybe I can leave my compact at home because I got a 1.3 or not a 1.0. I got a three. I got a three megapixel camera here. This isn't 3.0, but uh, yeah. Um, it was awesome. Anyways, to back to my point, Helio came out with all this cool shit, cool devices. Y'all need to Google search for those of you who don't know. Um, the Helio Ocean. That phone was awesome, and I had it. Um, and it was awesome. It was a, the first ever dual slider. So you slide up for a keyboard, and then or you could turn it and slide up that way for a keyboard. It was sick. Really sick. It was awesome. But, like I said, awesome for just a certain period of time. Then it became tiresome. Why? Because Helio, Helio, though it came out with this awesome stuff, never, ever upgraded anything. I was just stuck with that shit. Um, eventually it was bought out by Virgin Mobile, and then that was bought out by Sprint. And here I am with Sprint still. And, um, you know, I had the Evo one, and then now I have the Evo 3D, and, um, just as an Android user, I'm really getting tired of it. They're, they're doing upgrades. I mean, it is every blue moon, though, you know. And, uh, you know, yeah, I mean, I think everyone probably feels the same way I do, is just that we just, um, we just don't have much. Now, let me see here. When, it, oh, so my other, that was, I was going to connect those two. Um, Sprint and Helio, I feel like, are kind of in the same boat. Because, don't get me wrong, when the Evo first came out with, uh, I don't remember what it came out with, probably Android 2.1, that was still awesome. It had widgets. Um, you know what? Something I'm leaving out is that I, I've always had Sense. Um, so, of course, my Android 2.1 experience with Sense was probably different from someone... Uh, Elsa's experience with 2.1 because they probably didn't have Sense if they didn't have an HTC device. I always forget to add that because Sense just like, or HTC does their own shit with phones. They're like, oh, okay, all right, we're gonna uh, we're gonna ramp up our own shit, which is commendable. I mean, I like I like Sense 3.0, the carousel screen. But anyways, back to the point. I felt like I was let down by um, Android. It's just, it's just not what what I've been wanting. Um, and come on, we haven't, we don't still don't have a movie editor. A movie editor. We can't shoot movies and then edit them from the phone. And that sounds cool, but it's really stupid that we don't have it because uh, Apple's had that shit for years. Um. That'll be, of course, be on 4.0. Um, so that, and then just everything. It's just stuff that we've needed for so long, and now that it's here, I mean, there's the customization is crazy in the interface of 4.0. You just slide, slide, and it's just so sleek, beautiful, and just everything. Um, and then when you, and so you look at all those videos go look at those videos and then you just think about uh, the iOS 5 and you're just like the hell I mean it's not even in the same league to me I mean I'm not iOS 5 is nice it really is. I mean it's cool I'm just saying I mean if I'm if I'm walking in a store I'm getting an Android uh, that has 4.0 on it that's all I'm saying alright but that's all for today See you guys another day.